and welcome to Speed Secrets. This episode is brought to you by the guys at Summit Racing. You know, when it comes to LS motors, there are two distinct camps. On one side, we've got the Cathedral Port guys, and on the other, we've got the Rectangular Port guys. So naturally, a shootout was in order. Representing the Cathedral Port camp was a set of 799 heads, which are basically 243s with a different casting number. Representing the Rec Port guys was a set of 823 factory LS3 heads. So who's going to win? Let's check out our test motor and jump on the dyno. 2008 LY6 6 liter. We replaced the VVT cam with this healthy grind from Comp Cams. Both heads received a spring upgrade. 799 cylinder head specs. 799 heads run with dormant intake. Dialed in with a Holly ECU. Nice power curve from the 799s. LS3 heads are next. LS3 heads run with LS3 intake. The LS3 heads produced even more power. You know where they all are? Check out the power gains. The results are in and the rec port guys have to be really happy because the LS3 heads came out on top by almost 20 horsepower. I mean, that's a significant amount. But you know what? That doesn't tell the whole story because the 799 heads offered that much extra torque down low. So it really depends on where you want your power production. And before we go, we want you to think about one other thing. And that's the intake manifold used on each one of these applications. On the LS3, we use the factory LS3 manifold, which is good as it gets for that application. On the cathedral port application, we use a Dorman LS2, which is about the equivalent of a Trailblazer SS, which is the best factory manifold you can get, but certainly not the best manifold for that application. Think about this. If we were to take a fast manifold and put it on the LS3, we'd gain very little. If we were to take a fast manifold and put it on the 799 heads, we'd gain a ton. I'll bet it would almost equal the power output of that LS3. So that should give you guys plenty to argue about. I'm Richard Holdner. I want to thank the guys at Summit Racing. Join me next time on Speed Secrets.